stampers. Marilyn Wagner here with Stamping Creations with Marilyn. I'm going to show you how I made this sheltering tree sympathy card. Um, I'm going to try not to get the little extra dots on it this time, but it's always good, I find, to show my students that it's okay to make mistakes. They still look fine. Or if we call them mistakes, maybe they're not. So I am using the Sheltering Tree Photopolymer Stamp Set, Thoughts and Prayers Wood Stamp Set that I've had for quite a while, as you can see from the, the shape of the stamps, but they still stamp great. With some mint macaron, uh, early espresso for the, the tree trunk, and uh, punched a little butterfly to go on the in the tree, as you can see here. When I did the class, one of the ladies asked if she could tuck a vellum one underneath it, and it turned out great. It made it stand out a little more from the green on green, so I'm going to do that with today's card. So I will start the stamping. Again, with photopolymer, I like to use the piercing mat underneath it because it gives it a little more surface sponginess to work with. I am inking my tree. And I find on the bigger stamps it's better to turn it over like that to ink it. And try to get this in here where you can see what I'm doing. Just stamping the tree kind of near the top because I want to be able to put the land stripe underneath it and some words as well. So my tree in the early espresso, my grass or land grounding effect, whatever, is in the mint macaron. And that's the one that I kind of had extra ink for some reason all over it. Just to kind of ground the, the tree a bit. Then I am going to find my other stamp. Do some leaves in the lighter color first. And I line that up with the tree trunk in this empty little spot here. Photopolymer usually leaves sit for a count of 10. And I will have to clean up before I can finish it. But I will put the words on, and that is in the wild wasabi I've chosen as my second ink. And I think I'm going to use this side and try to stamp it straight. While I've got that, I will stamp a burst on the inside in the wild wasabi. Especially when it comes to sympathy cards, I find it sometimes difficult to think of what to say, so it's nice to have. And again, did it crooked, so I'll try again. Great, but a little better. So I will have to remember which side I want that out on. I have used this bitty butterfly punch to punch out a butterfly. I will put some rhinestones on, or maybe some pearls on this one. I like the pearls, as you can see here. And I will uh, have another card done. Just going to uh, stamp that other color on the tree to give it a bit of 3D dimension. 
So here we are with the second color of green, and this one I have chosen Wild Wasabi. It's the one I used for the, the words on the front of the card. I'm going to ink up my, my leaf stamp, and because I don't want it exactly where the other one was, I'm going to turn it just a bit to give it a little bit of filled in dimension. You can still see the tree trunk is, is there, but you can see that the stamp is turned. And there we have the shaded effect. So next would be to attach it to the card base and through the magic of video, I already have snail on this piece. And I find that I don't need that. And I'm going to see if I can line it up straight. And <clears throat> hopefully got a right side up. There we go. I find I don't like to run my hands over it this way to burnish it, so I usually turn them over and just do this to make sure the adhesive is attached. Then I will take my blue dots and attach my two butterflies, my vellum butterfly just a little bit off center so that you can see the vellum this way a little bit on the side and then another glue dot and a little bit of bending to put my butterfly on my tree follow that up with some pearls and again <clears throat> I like to use my attached ones if possible when I do the butterflies so I will get two and a single one didn't quite work but there's three of them and I have another completed card that I can put in my my box for sympathy card. <laughs> 